Okay, let's talk about these grids. For changing them, you can right click grid properties or in 2D grid properties or F12. Or you can go to the setting grid properties. If you select the grid property setting, as you can see, we have two tab, 2D grid and 3D grid, or you can adjust the grid brightness. For 2D grid, you can show, turn it off or on, very simple. You can uh, adjust it to a snap to the grid. As you can see, if you turn on a snap to grid, the grid will be turned darker. And now, you, if, you, you, if you go to the polygon, as you can see, you can snap to the grid. And uh, as you can see, the distance, it means <clears throat> if you zoom, as you can see, distance from this to this is one centimeter. And because of the auto adjustment distance to zoom, it means if you going back, this is five, 10. As you can see, it's automatically uh, delete the inner box for showing better, as you can see. And if you don't want to auto adjust, you can turn it off. And as you can see, this is one centimeter one and it's always fixed this is all about auto adjust and the distance you can change the distance between the grids any number in centimeter that you want to the arrow key moment one centimeter if you go into edit pattern and select one pattern you can uh, snap it or adjust it you can right click and turn off grid to a snap as you can see they're turn uh, the opacity and here you can move it or you can move it with your arrow key with the left right up down it if you use your arrow key to move the points it move one centimeter that you define it or line. As you can see, it's nice. With, with, with your arrow key, you can move them. Right click. And this to the arrow key, key, key movement in the centimeter is here, you can define it. Another thing, it's in a 3D, 3D grid. You can turn on or off. You can move your object in a 3D. Okay, movement one centimeter as 2D. And here you can change the opacity of the axis just. Nice. You can change the opacity of the axis here. Nice. You can right click anywhere. Yeah, this is opacity of main axis here. The main axis. I make it darker. No, I like it. So you can change the brightness of them. Main axis and other axis, other grids. So you can access the grid properties from right click anywhere in a 2D and 3D or go into the setting and grid properties or use a shortcut. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.